Jake is going to the vet today. Jake has been fighting cancer for about the past, I guess, six months. And it's been a rough battle. Uh, he's fighting two forms of cancer. First one is a blood cancer uh, that created a big mass in his, his leg. Uh, that's just a big sack that just filled up with blood. The other one's another kind of cancer. It's a skin cancer. It's on his sides, on his ribs, something like that. So we've had one surgery already to get those removed. Some of the complications were the area was is on the inside of his leg, and it had had the skin tore. So basically, the stitches they stitched it up, but then it's in an area that moves a lot on his leg and it tore the skin. I had a line of stitches that ran down the center, but then the skin was torn on either side. So that's why he's in the cast that he is. And now we're going to get the cast rechanged, the bandage, so we have to mobilize legs so that skin can heal. Now, everything else is healing fine. So it's one of these things where it has to be changed every few days, and uh, it just takes time out of your schedule, and you got to go do it. Jake has a cast that matches my shirt, so that's pretty cool. Checkup went well. Got another scheduled visit later in the week. One of the things I want to talk about is there's a lot of people, me included, who see pets as part of the family too. They live with us, they play with us, and they bring a lot of joy to our lives. It's especially heartbreaking when you have to watch one of them suffer. What makes matters more difficult is not being able to pay for the care that they need. There's consultation costs, there's possibly surgery, medication costs, and then there's always a follow-up visit, and all that can add up. So one of the things that I want to start doing in my life personally is contributing to a charity that helps families pay for those medical costs so that they can have more time with their loved ones. Uh, in the comments below, I'll have some charities that I've looked into. I, you know, I don't endorse any one over the other, anything like that. That's why I'm putting a multiple choice. Uh, so you can pick and choose, or maybe you have one that you, you like, maybe put in the comments, I'll look into it. But there's a couple of local charities, there's some national charities that I've seen that uh, help families pay for the medical costs of the pets. Because when you contribute that, you're not just impacting one life, you're impacting several lives, right? You're, you're making the family happier and better, and you're giving them more time to be with that, that special animal that they care for. So. so there's other ways you can donate. You can no, donate not only just money, but you can also donate time. The donations of dog food are appreciated. Uh, office supplies, even things like uh, toner cartridges. Some nonprofits can uh, use toner cartridges to turn them in and get credits for new toner cartridges and helps help save on the costs. There's a lot of ways you can help with. Let me get in. Hello. Uh, kitties are even supported too. So even kitties need donations too. So we got we got puppies and we got kitties. Uh, every little bit helps and it's greatly appreciated. Well, thanks for watching. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe. Until then, we'll see you next time.